Hey guys, and welcome to episode 5 of the Celta Vigo career mode series. In this episode, we'll be playing the remaining three matches of the first half of La Liga, which are Espanol, Granada, and Athletic Bilbao. And here we are at the Stadio Clasico at home facing Espanol. Can we win against Espanol? They're mid table, and, um,. I think we can. Beauvu's still going here. We can serve Dras- or that's Baganda, and it's saved. Now oh, that's beautiful, Beauvu. Beauvu, blast it! Damn it. Oh no. Oh my god, what a save, Ruben Blanco. You can find Voss with the volley! A great chance there, and it's another save for the keeper, man. So at halftime, we have dominated Espanyol, and their goalkeeper is pretty insane, to say the least. Um, our best chance was probably that Voss volley, and I swear, man, if that went in, I would have gone insane. But anyways, we'll look at the match facts real quick. And as you can see, we've had 67% of possession, 6 shots, and 4 on target. We need to get a goal in the second half. We need to. There we go. Bogonda. That's a pen! Yes! Finally! Finally, we have, enough, we have a chance to actually go up 1-0 here. Alright, who is our best uh, penalty taker here? I think it's uh, Biovu. Yeah, it is. Okay, come on, Biovu. Make it 1-0. He dies! And it's 1-0 to Celta Vigo. Finally get the goal, man. It's about goddamn time. What? However this is happening, that was, that was not meant to happen. There's Voss, and yet again, this goalkeeper saves it! Solid 1-0 win. Honestly, should have been more than 1-0, but you know what? It's fine. Job done. Three points in the bag. Our man of the match, though, goes to Lopez, the goalkeeper, of course. He had five saves. Five really good saves that kept um, Espanol in this game for a long time. Okay, so we're back. Had to simulate the uh, match against uh, Espanol because my game decided to crash. But we still got the win, which is good. We're still in second place. We're actually three points behind Real Madrid now, which is great. And the sad thing is, Daniel Vaz got a red card in that match. Training sessions for Koulibaly, Malo, um, Johnny, and Vaz. And as you can see, Johnny upgrades just a bit. He's almost halfway to a 79. And uh, Koulibaly, yeah, and Koulibaly, maybe in the next training session, we'll get to an 82, which would be actually sick. Now, here we are, facing Granada. Now, this, this could be going either way here, because I have a feeling I'm not going to play as well as I have been, but, but we'll see. Oh, snap. Great tackle, Radoha. They still have it, though. Great save, Sergio. Okay. Snap. Oh, Yep, like I said, I wouldn't be playing as great as I did in the last match. Come on, guys, maybe we can get the equalizer. Just maybe, you know, Voss was kind of... Um, yeah, we kind of miss Voss now. Yeah, we definitely do miss Voss. And at halftime, it is 1-0. Yeah, we haven't really had the greatest of halves, you know. You win some, you lose some, and right now we're kind of losing. So, you know... Voss is definitely important in our midfield, and it's showing, because Diaz has really not been that great. Radoha! And it's blocked. Drasic! Yes, there we go. Possibly, possibly! They ask you how you are, you just have to say that you're fine. You're not really fine, but you just our man of the match, though, goes to Sergio. He was pretty good in this match. He had five saves. Of course, our goalkeepers are always good. 
I don't know why, it's just like that. Training sessions for Drasich, Koulibaly, and Johnny, and, and Malo. And as you can see, Koulibaly, maybe in the next training session, he'll become an 82. And here we are, facing Athletic Bilbao at home. We're back at home after a disappointing loss against Granada. Let's bounce back, guys. If it is Athletic Bilbao, it's going to be a harder match. And also, we're not playing Nolito, all right? I'm done with Nolito for now, until maybe the next episode. I'm just, I'm just done with him. Hernandez. Hernandez. Yes, it's a pen! Oh my god, I didn't think that was going to be a pen, but it is. And now, for Alana to take the penalty. Is he our best penalty taker? I believe he is, so I guess he'll take it then. Come on, score it. Yes! There we go, already 1-0 up. We've scored so many penalties in this series, but I, I don't really care. And so it is half time. We get the early goal, and it's really just been our half after that. I mean, Athletic really just making a ton of mistakes after we scored for some reason. But um, in the second half, how about we put on no lead zone? Well, at least we'll put him on later, okay? Snap, snap. How did he miss that? What a save, Sergio. Oh, snap. I just gave it right back to him, and he hits the post. Oh, my God. Oh, that's a great ball. No Lito. Or not Nolito. Hernandez to Iago Aspas, and it's 2-0. Here we go. Nolito. He finds Hernandez, who can finish it. He's made it 3-0. Yet again, another counterattack. And yet again, another goal. And, oh, snap. I didn't even close the game there. <laughs> but anyways, we have won 3-0. Don't know why it was so silent at the end of the whistle. But anyways, let's go to our man of the match real quick. It is Hernandez. He had a goal and an assist. So well done, Pablo. You definitely deserve it. And just like that, that is the end of episode 4. So, let's go check out basically the uh, fixtures for the next episode, shall we? Okay, so in the next episode, we have quite the fixtures here. We first have a match against Athletic Bilbao, and then we'll face Atletico Madrid, and then we'll face Bilbao yet again. But anyways, guys, that is the end of episode 4. Hopefully you guys enjoyed the video. Hopefully you guys are enjoying the series. I've gotten a bit of feedback um, saying that this, this is a good series so that's good to know but anyways guys um if we can get 15 likes on this video that would be awesome anyways guys if you have any suggestions for pledges i can buy in the january transfer window be sure to leave that down below as well as if you have any suggestions for things i can improve on this series be sure to leave that down below as well anyways guys if you like the video be sure to like it and if you feel like it go ahead and subscribe to my channel i'll see you guys later Love peace.